Hello everybody, it's Mark from Don Aim at Leisure. Thank you for joining me today on a really cold day here at the showground at Don Aim at Leisure in Hilton. So today we've got for you a treat of a camper van. It's a 2024 recently registered pre-owned low miles. So at the minute it's got 709 miles on Swift Carrera 122. So it's a 2024 model, 2024 spec, uh, and it's really, really lovely. Uh, finished in the real nice sort of matte grey spec. And then uh, you've got this uh, lovely black and blue decals that really complement the van and go all the way down the sides as well uh, black and chrome finished alloy wheels from fiat um, it's on the 2.2 manual 140 horsepower engine and gearbox um, you've got cab blinds so with a new style at the front as well these are like the honeycomb sort of more insulated cab blinds on the doors windscreen and passenger door as well uh, going down this side we've got external shower point just there toilet cassette just underneath a little bit further back just here you've got your electric hookup point round to the back of the van swifts have got parking sensors but no rear camera and then for the 2024 model when you open up the barn doors you've also got your rear fly screen that pulls all the way across and then you've got this nice little sort of pull out bench table on the rear door as well i think that's a really really sort of cute option especially if you're parked onto a spot and you've got tables and chairs set out um it's really nice storage wise everything under the left hand side is storage drawers so you can open that pull these out from the front and then you've got these drawers inside as well um on the opposite side you need to be aware that obviously you've got your gas locker which sits yeah. underneath there so there's space for a couple of small gas bottles and then you've got your table port just there so the table is mounted uh, sort of behind the driver's seat and you can turn this into a small sort of little dinette area uh, all of the windows have got blackout blinds and fly nets on so uh, like that and then they'll go on all the side windows right the way down the lake for the van as well going down the passenger side to the rear here we've got um, an external gas barbecue point just at the top you've got your wind out awning and then you've also got 100 watt solar panel on the roof it is there <laughs> you just can't see it uh, and then just there you've got your uh, water infill um electric step when you open up the side door you've got obviously uh, fly screen number two uh nice again a little uh, drop down worktop table so you can have table and chairs outside external power socket uh, step control and then your bin is hidden away neatly in there and then this piece here lifts up slots in and then you've got a worktop Big extension worktop. yeah, yeah. Um, and then if you yeah. want to jump in and we'll have a look at the cab so yeah. we're right in the center of the cab um you've got that uh, uh touch screen so you've got sort of uh, apple carplay so if you can connect all your mobile apps and um, all the controls for the air conditioner in the middle there as well and then you can see you've got a few, a few sort of usb plug-in points for mobile controls as well uh, on the steering wheel it's a bit smaller than normal bit chunky nice dis digital da display dash and then you've got driver and passenger seat that both rotate round yeah. uh, sky view light over the passenger and driver seat as well so it lets a not natural night in and then behind the driver's seat you've got your fridge freezer nice little storage locker uh, yeah that opens from both sides and then hidden away just here but it's kind of hidden but in plain sight if you get what i mean because you don't know it's there um tabletop sits in there and then you've got your nice little storage cupboard um and you've got a hanging rail at the top there as well yeah opposite that you've got your kitchen area so lots and lots of storage underneath nice little sink and then next to it you've got your two ring gas burner um lots and lots of storage all the way through the kitchen area as well into the living space yeah. and then opposite us we've got the uh, toilet shower sort of all in one cubicle fold out sink so you can leave that in or out so you can get a bit more space um and then obviously you've got your nice well, really well illuminated uh, van with the led strips that run all the way across right the way down the length and then you've got your little led spotlight reading lamps underneath the units as well um heating and hot water controls are right next to the um, habitation door so dead simple to use wave your hand in front of them to wake them up and then you've got gas selection electric selection uh, temperature sort of that sort of thing yeah. nice and easy to use and then your nice contract um, compact control panel so that tells you all about your battery uh, temperature battery levels um, yeah. light dimmer all that sort of stuff and mains power so that's all on there dead simple okay. um the total length of the van is 5.99 meters this one is manual and it just it comes under the three and a half that uh, key uh, 3500 kilo category so it can be driven on a standard car license 
Um, the two sofas at the back can be used as two single beds if you want to, but they can also convert into one large double. Um, it is only a two traveller van, so there are no other seat belts other than the driver's seat and passenger seat. So yeah. don't be tempted to take anybody with you. Um, and then uh, it's a really, really lovely van. It's really well looked after. It's got transferable manufacturer's warranty as well, being sort of this side of the 2024 plate. Yeah. Uh, and it's got really low mileage. So it's available to view. It's here on site. And if you'd like any other information or to talk to us about arranging test drives or a uh, part exchange inquiry, give us a call. My name's Mark. Thank you very much for your time. See you soon.